Uh, only? No, because he created me. He owns me. He remember this, that he owns you. Okay, who has cars? You have cars. You have cars. What kind of cars? That is too hard for me. Honda. Honda, good. What about you? Ford. Ford, okay. Can your manual fit the Ford car? You have the manufacturer manual of the Honda Civic if you said that, right? Can that, if, if Munta has problem with her car, to tell you, please give me your manual to find a solution? You said, it doesn't fit you. Go look for your manual. Can you use hers? Who has the manual of all of us? The one we found. He knows, like the car, for your car. They say in the car, when to make the tune-up. Every, for example, every six months or every four, whatever. I'm not so perfect in car. Those guys, oh, they are like devils in the car. I don't know how they get this information. But anyway, okay? So, that's my honesty. From the second wife. Because the first wife died. And she uh, granted me one son, older than him. How many years? Seven years. Seven years. That is my oldest. <coughs> but this one is the oldest of his mom, as a boy. I don't know if he, you saw Mariam. Mariam is my oldest from the second wife. Okay. And that second wife, she is to me, she is a whole life to me. Because she maintained the life of my son after his mother died. She accepted one like me, who is a boy, six years old. She had a big chance to get a better guy than me a hundred times. Yeah. Maybe more handsome, maybe more rich, maybe many maybes. At least to start to clean without a stranger baby, six years old. But she accepted that and she suffered to maintain him and to, create, to raise him up till he become a man. Real man. I count on him after a lot of years. Okay? So, regardless what she may do to me, she's still everything to me. Why? Because of what she did to me and the best of me. And the worst time in my life. When I lost my wife. And now I'm, I'm, I'm really lost. I, don't, I cannot even wash the socks of the boy. I don't know how to wash. And she just like a drawing guy, and somebody, all of a sudden somebody left him. She did that to me. Regardless what she may do to me in the life, she will remain the main person in my life. And I have to make, provide everything to make her happy, even if she make me crazy. But she's still my, my best person in my life, okay? Because all women, all women alike, they have a touch of craziness, right? <laughs> but without that touch of craziness, you cannot enjoy your life with this wife. Assume she is not, she's like you, straight mind. Oh my God, I'm, I'm married to a man like me or what? No, you need to see the difference. So, I like creating the woman like that. And Messenger of Allah Sallallahu said, the women, I like create the women from a rib. None of you study medicine, do you? None of you love biology? You do? You know how the rib look like? Correct. Yes. Rasulullah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said, the woman been created from the, the rib of Adam. He was asleep. Allah put him to sleep. Allah picked up one of his ribs without surgery. It's Allah, he does what he wants. And ordered that trip to become a beautiful woman, the best woman Allah created ever with his hand. Okay? Eve, what do you want? Oh, I just thought that was a metaphor the whole time. Huh? I never knew that that actually happened. No, that happened. Yeah, I thought it was just a metaphor. You know? No, that happened because Rasulullah said, the woman being created from a rib. 
and the most bent rib uh, part of the rib is the head of the rib because the ribs are connected to this bone here in the chest from the, the, the biggest part the rib looked like that looked like that this is the rib this solid part and this is so this part to become a beautiful woman 60 yards high Mother Eve, 60, right to the and you will enter the paradise with that size. If you now five, five feet, you will be 60 yards. All right? You will be 60 yards. Don't worry. Okay? Don't worry. 60 yards. You will be the width about 20 feet. <coughs> I have a question. Yes? I read somewhere that they said that otherwise Adam was the most handsome. Who? Adam? Adam? The most handsome one was Joseph. No, no, but I heard that um, mm. Adam and Eve, they were more special because Adam oh, yes. created them with their, his own hands, hands, right? But the thing is, doesn't Allah make every person with his hands? No. Allah created Adam with his own hand. And they put into him a system for us to yeah. come through the sperm. Okay. okay? So Allah didn't create any one of us by his own hand. He created us by the direct command B. Okay? But Adam was created directly by the, the glory hand of Allah. Okay? Allah created four things with his own hand. Anything else by direct command B. And it's, it was. So he created Adam. He created the pen. The first pen to, to script what Allah wants to believer enter the paradise and this believer enter the hellfire. Everything is written. Okay? The pen, add the pen, the throne, the paradise with his own hand. Okay? Anything else Allah creates from every creature here, male and female. Allah says, Min kulli shayin khalaqna so chicken, don't listen to those crazy guys who say, which first, the egg or the chicken? The chicken. All right? All right? Because, all right, the chicken. Yes, Allah was able to, to create an egg, fertilized egg, without male chicken or female chicken. But it is not his sunnah, because Allah has sunnah. And the Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam the sunnah of Allah is the general command of Allah. So sunnah of Allah is to create the flower. The flower has male part and female part. Allah created the goats, for example, male goat, uh, she goat, he goat, okay? Cows, camel, uh, even the flies, male fly and the female fly. He created a pair of everything you see with direct command. Okay? So this earth becomes full of everything once he said be. Because he doesn't need to name every creature. He just, he knows what he wants. So once he said for creatures to be. So all else become immediately pair of each other. And they start to multiply. Understand? So nothing Allah created. Nothing except the four things I told you by his own hand. Other things, they've been created with the direct command. And this is, if you believe that, this is from Tawheed. So to review, the things he made with his own hands were Adam, Eve? No, not Eve. Not Eve, okay. Eve, direct command. The pen? The pen, and the throne, the throne. Mm -hmm. his own throne. Okay. 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 Adam, the pen. Okay. Throne, the paradise. Okay? So, All right. um, that's why Adam's children could mate, right? Like at that time, obviously. Could what? They could have, they could, you know, be together, married. His okay. children, right? At that time. Like, no, no, I will explain to you okay. how Allah did it. Okay? Adam and Eve, if they will deliver babies right. or produce babies, right. they're supposed to be what? 
Sisters and brothers. Right. Okay. Look at what Allah did. Every time Eve become pregnant, she delivered twin. Boy and again. Boy and again. Okay? Allah, with a direct command, put in each pair certain attributes. Right. One black, one white. Right. For was, example. The dust was different, color, different soils? Yes. So all the genes stored in Adam started to be reflected in each time of pregnancy. And he decided and ordered Adam to marry the boy of the first time to the girl of the second time. Because it's completely far attributes. All right? Because his own sister close attributes. So the, this, the, the girl from the first time to the boy of the second time. And many things like that till Allah establish all the kinds you see of human being. Red, yellow, Chinese guy, eyes like this, or eyes like that, whatever, all right? So they become different because of that, okay? And all of them, they were talking one language. After the flood in the time of Noah, all who had been saved with Noah, little number. Let's say 50 guys. Noah Noah survived 1,150 years, and he gave the invitation to Allah for 950 years. They used, like years of us, they used to live a lot, long time. Adam lived 1,000 years, okay? What our average 60 to 70? We become less in size because they were tall, they were giants. Adam 60 yards, for example, Noah 40 yards, for example, Musa 20 yards, for example, Jesus, and till the time of Rasulullah was our size. Okay? Why our size? Because the risk of the earth, if a thousand guy will eat, that was enough meal for Adam in his time. Adam by himself can eat what one thousand of us eat now. So it's a balance. Right? Big size. The chicken of Adam could be a dinosaur, baby dinosaur. Chicken of Adam, comparable with, uh, if you compare between his size and the dinosaur size. He is bigger than the dinosaur. He's 60 yards high. He is bigger than the dinosaur. The dinosaur is 30 yards or whatever, he's bigger. So he can capture any dinosaur like that and eat or slaughter from those who eat grass. Whatever. I'm just imagining. Okay? I don't have proof of that. So, uh, Allah created Eve with direct command. The rib, Allah ordered the rib to be a woman. And she become your mom. Why Allah didn't create two women? Can you answer me? Come on. Pairs. He created pairs. Allah created Adam first. And then created a spouse for him. Why he didn't create two, three, four? If every prophet has three, four, five uh, <coughs> wives, okay? So why Allah didn't create more than one wife for Adam? Mm. Think. You know why? Okay. A man nowadays, if he's married a, a Saudi girl, an Egyptian girl, Bengali girl, and the Yemeni girl, all right? The children of the Yemeni will say, oh, we are better than the Saudi children because our mother is Yemeni. All right, understand the point now? So because we have to have the same mother, so we feel that there is no difference between us. Nobody to show up above another one, okay? Don't show off, don't think you are better than others. You are from the same father, from the same mother. All right? Maybe you're tall, you're short, you're young, you're big, you're small, but you're from the same mother. You should mercy one another. You should love one another. Understand? Huh? You sure? Mm -hmm. Okay. So the attributes of Allah, how many kinds? Three. First one? To worship Allah. Well, He mm. created everything. Now I want you to, to, to try to say it in Arabic. Tawheed. Arubu Repeat. Tawheed. Arubu 
means there is only one creator. One owner, one provider. That's the three together as Rubu Bia. Okay? He is a Rabb. Okay? The creator. If you need anything, you ask the Rabb. Like if you need anything, you go to your mom or to your father. I need for the car, a, a new car. I need a sneaker. I need uh, oh my car is broken. I need another car. Whatever. So whatever you need, you ask who? The provider. The owner. The creator. But whenever you want to show your gratefulness, you bow to that one. So what you're doing now is Tawheed al uluhiyya Tawheed al uluhiyya Can you read Arabic? Slightly. Slightly too? Okay. I want you to be sure about everything. Okay. Here, Tawheed, I want you to... Tawheed al Tawheed al Al-Rububiyya from Rab. What do you call this? Razor. Okay, Al-Rububiyya from Rab. From the word Rab. Mean Lord. Okay. Al-Uluhiyya from the word Ilah. Ilah. Okay. Ilah. I. La. Hun. Ilah. Okay. Ilah, I don't know how to say it in English. Do you have a strong ex uh, translation? Like one. Hmm? Like one, right? No, no. He is one, too. Ilah. But this is the one who deserves to be worshipped. The Rabb is the same as who? He is the same. Okay? So, but this, when we need something from him, related to our life, and this, when we want to show him appreciation. So we look at him as Ilah, we bow and we prostrate. Okay? So Tawheed al rububiyya You want me to write it in English? Right. That writing in English is not good. Okay. Write it like that. Tawheed al al ru Bu Bi I I I Rubu Bi Yeah Okay, that's I Tawheed al Rubu Bi The one who created Who owns, who provides Tawheed al Rubu Bi From the word Rub Mean the Lord. Okay? You have also Tawheed Al U U O or U? You. You? Al U Lu This is O. He Yeah. If I if, if, if it need to be corrected, tell me. Well, I would do U L. U L directly? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Tawheed al u luhiya. Okay? From the word ilah. The one I worship. Okay? And we have also Tawheed. Tawheed al asma. Al Asma. Huh? Wa means and wa this equal and al si fat. Al Asma, the names, best of names, the sifat, best of attributes. Okay? These are the three types. I compress it together for you all now. Um, did you 
you want to do a maghrib here or for the masjid? Why? What the? Oh my God, I have to run. Yeah, that does too. All right, because I have a visitor coming for me from Atlantic City, New Jersey. <laughs> and I promised him to be in the masjid by maghrib time. I didn't, I didn't feel the time. Oh. So I see you next week. Sure. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to prepare it, and I will ask you. It will be a test. Okay. Assalamu alaikum.